Hai apa khabar semua Jadi mula hari ini Saya akan share dengan anda semua Segala benda yang pasal suhu Kita nak tengok all the tips and tricks Best practices And we also going to see How these uh, applications Can help in our Day to day running of our business Nama saya Azlan And I'm a Zoho fanboy Uh, Zoho is a cloud software atau lebih dikenali sebagai software as a service or in a short form SaaS. So apa apa dia SaaS ni? SaaS typically is a, a software whereby kita tak perlu any installation. Everything is on the cloud as long as we have internet, we can access it. And of course uh, some SaaS comes with a free plan uh, but most of the time uh, they will Uh, ask us to pay for the subscription but sebab kalau tak macam nak buat duit lah kan uh, and SAS pun kita tak perlukan any server uh, within our premise uh, so in a way uh, the cost of ownership untuk kita uh, gunakan software ni uh, tak tinggi kita cuma uh, kena allocate some budget untuk kita gunakan uh, part of our OPEX atau kita punya operation cost uh, untuk melanggan uh, service uh, software uh, macam SaaS products ni ok so uh, Zoho in a nutshell is a business suite whereby uh, ada banyak types of uh, software untuk tolong kita in every department of our business ada untuk sales in the form of Zoho CRM ada untuk marketing kalau nak hantar marketing campaign ke nak hantar uh, nak buat social media posting ke uh, that's a tool for it uh, and then dia ada for accounting Zoho Books uh, in which we gonna talk in detail uh, in this video uh, dia ada juga for HR uh, Zoho People and tak lupa juga Zoho Mail uh, in which uh, it is one of the Uh, most popular Zoho product uh, lagi dekat kita ni uh, dekat Malaysia ni uh, satu because it's quite stable dia boleh put our own domain to the to Zoho Mail and of course sebab harga dia harga marahin so murah uh, untuk pakai and other than that ada banyak lagi ada for recruitment ada for digital signing project management inventory management Um, IT help desk um, and my personal favorite I would say uh, Zoho Click so Zoho Click ni is kalau kita nak samakan is is a chat tool ni macam sama lah macam WhatsApp Telegram ke apa semua kan but in which that this one dia can only be accessed by your own organization so why is it my favorite because uh, I know that I can separate what's work and what's Uh, personal so kalau saya tengok phone ni saya tengok phone saya tengok kalau banyak je notification merah tu dekat klik tu uh, if it's within business hour I have to attend to it uh, if it's after business hour I will have the option not to attend to it and same goes to my clicks as well uh, but kalau semua benda dalam whatsapp kita kena buka lah kan nak kena check kan mana satu kerja mana satu yang bos cari mana satu yang orang minta chase kita, follow up dengan kita kita nak promote work life balance sekarang semua orang nak work life balance work life balance kan so, one way of doing it is uh, through separating the uh, chat lah ok and saya tak kata Zoho Click je boleh buat banyak lagi benda benda kat luar kat sana tapi uh, disebabkan kita nak cakap pasal Zoho segala benda Zoho so uh, that's why about this and tak lupa juga Zoho ada online meeting tu called Zoho meeting tapi dia punya uh, quality or delivery still meh lagi lah belum boleh lawan Zoho boleh boleh lawan uh, Google Meet or Teams uh, if you're not on Zoho jangan ada ada nak pakai Zoho meeting uh, that's from a Zoho fanboy uh, himself uh, tapi kalau macam saya ni memang dah ingrain dah Zoho ni dalam 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 badan ni kan nak nak kena lah uh, uh, pakai Zoho sebab dah bayar and it comes it comes with the package takkan nak 
subscribe to other service lagi. Okay, let's talk about Zoho's cloud accounting software which is Zoho Books. Okay, this is Zoho Books in logo dia. So, it's a quite a comprehensive uh, accounting software I would say. Ada banyak cloud accounting software dekat luar sana. Um, that is similar like this. Uh, one of the popular ones, of course, I think uh, banyak orang mesti tahu pasal Zero. And ada QuickBooks Online. Now, let's focus on uh, Zoho Books. Again, being a Zoho product is a SaaS. Everything's on the cloud. So, it means that uh, all the data uh, is being updated on a real-time basis, reports, financial reports can be churned out anytime, anywhere. Dengan syarat, kita ada internet. So, in a way, uh, with the cloud accounting software, our accounts department or finance department can work remotely. Kan, dulu masa awal MCO tu, alamak, orang account kena pergi office sebab nak arah payroll. Kalau tak pergi office, gaji orang tak bayar. Kalau tak pergi office, tak boleh buat payment to vendor. Kalau tak pergi office, tak boleh proses invoice. But if you have cloud accounting software, not just promoting Zoho Books, but if you have a cloud accounting software, you can let your employees or your finance department to work anywhere as long as they have internet. Okay. Ada a few functions atau features yang saya suka. One of it is the uh, banking module yang best ni sebab uh, Zoho is one of the few uh, cloud accounting software yang ada integration dengan our local Malaysian banks uh, ada 14 if not mistaken macam mana nak tengok dia boleh tekan add bank ni type dalam Malaysia kan so ada ni uh, but later I will also share it in the link inside the description you can see the list of banks uh, that are connected with uh, Zoho Books ok so apa yang best ni kalau kita boleh connect kita punya bank account ni ok ok but before I go into that saya nak explain dulu ok how cloud software atau cloud accounting software connects our bank accounts they don't store our uh, bank credentials on their servers be it Zoho ke, Zero ke, QuickBooks ke uh, sebab uh, that will uh, not comply with their own privacy punya policy so what they do is that they ada they subscribe to this financial aggregator service for Zoho's case it is called Yodli uh, yeah, Yodli ni lah yang akan simpan data tu of course it is encrypted and on a daily basis, they are connect our bank account and try to pull uh, our bank transaction and push it to the software service lah. So, for this case, it's, it is Zoho. Kita akan nampak uh, this green icon in which you will see bank fees are active. So, kalau kita klik, kita boleh tengok semua bank transaction kita yang dalam uh, uh, apa tu, dalam account kita within our cloud accounting software so apa yang best ya kita boleh klik uh, the line item tu nanti ok and then uh, system kalau if let's say we have an existing transactions within the uh, within our accounting uh, income ke be expense ke uh, kita boleh buat matching system will uh, propose to us what's the best transaction based on the amount based on the description and kita boleh buat matching so apa maksud benda ni semuanya this means that we can actually do bank recon day to day basis so with such a software or we can at least in, uh, introduce such a control bye bye kalau tak ada benda-benda semua ni tak ada proof apa semua uh, jangan bagi lepas cakap sistem tak allow so that's one way of this to teach our superior or our boss uh, to follow uh, procedures Okay, so that's that's about the banking module. Kena ada benda lain macam the sales module tu normal lah semua pun ada. Purchase module pun semua ada. But lagi satu yang saya suka for oh, every transaction yang kalau kita uh, create okay, kita buka 
Dalam Zoobox dia akan tunjuk the journal entry dia For each language Contohnya macam invoice kan Invoice Dia akan tunjuk ah, Dia debit account mana ah, credit, credit account mana So this is the uh, Double entry Yang Most uh, Accountants uh, Are looking at Or Want to see So at least within the transaction Rather than Going back Into the Accounts level From the transaction itself Kita dah boleh nampak apa ni So this one for me Is one of the Key reason why I like uh, So books uh, Number three Is the uh, Portal access So dalam uh, So books it, it Came with A built-in portal access For both our customer And also for our vendor Maksudnya Uh, for every customer yang kita ada Atau for every vendor yang kita ada Dalam sistem kita Kita boleh allow portal access to them So what they can do Kalau untuk customer Kalau dia masuk portal Contoh saya bagi sample So bila dia login Dia boleh nampak invoice yang dah di issue kepada dia dia boleh nampak dia punya outstanding kalau ada credit being uh, given to them and uh, kalau ada uh, payment and they can also print out statements as well and kalau dia vendor pula dia, yang the best thing is that dia boleh upload dokumen dia dekat sini so kalau I nak submit invoice to you kalau you pakai Zoho Books I bagi I bagi you portal access I can Make it such a process whereby If you want to bill me You can only send your invoice through my portal Kalau you hantar pakai channel lain I takkan layan, tak ada orang nak tengok My finance semua proses So make sure you pakai proses So benda-benda macam ni Kalau for big enterprise customer uh, You take millions uh, uh, For you to invest To have such a feature uh, Whereby You ada portal untuk your supplier uh, To upload their documents Tapi With Zoho Everything comes uh, Either kalau customer portal tu is free But the vendor portal uh, Is available in the In either professional Ataupun premium plan Dia tengok lah nanti ya So yeah, in a nutshell uh, Those are the uh, Three features That I strongly Uh, like about Zoho Books uh, I would recommend uh, to all business owners uh, to start to implement your accounting on the cloud so tak kisahlah kalau you nak ambil Zoho ke tak kan tapi it's up to you because the benefits are abundance uh, kita boleh macam saya cakap tadi staff kita boleh kerja pada mana-mana kita boleh generate report uh, anytime that we like uh, better decision making and this one uh, business owners tak semestinya if you just running if you're running a big business uh, you can apply to micro business kalau kita hawker jual barang tak pun jual makanan dari rumah buat kek lah apa semua apa salahnya the accounting system at least there's one place for us to record everything So also comes with a free plan Boleh pakai mm, Small business Boleh pakai Startup founders Lagilah boleh pakai Sebab startup ni Selalu Saya tengok ni kan They have Really fantastic idea Magnificent idea So you nak selesaikan masalah orang ni So you nak selesaikan masalah orang ni Audience ni Audience tu ah, Come up with MVP Come up with the product Cantik segala badai Pick sini, pick sana Dia tanya What do you use for your accounting? Excel sahaja hmm. ah, Mana mahu itu ke? So We'll continue on the next uh, video We'll take a look at other products pula And maybe I'll do some tips and tricks uh, videos as well Okay Terima kasih banyak Stay safe everyone Sama-sama kita Kurangkan kes harian uh, Increase vaccination uh, Dan Kita tolong Sesama kita Kita jaga kita Bye
Assalamualaikum.